All right, guys, here we go. Group break 4,001. And there you go. If you're in chat, guys, on the website, make sure you pick which team you think is going to hit the low number. Actually, we do better for this. Every card number 25 or less, so orange or better, typically in a hobby case, we're going to land like six plus oranges. So lots of winners typically on this one. Hey, Detroit, send us an email, though, with pictures. Please. We actually had another one this week. It's like, it'd be nice for me to be able to see if it was... Because if, if, yours, if yours looks like the other one, then that could tell us that, hey, this happened at a local facility before they split off and went their separate ways, you know? So, even though there's not a ton that the post office is going to... They're not going to do anything about it. Still, definitely let us know and... and Seriously, let us know what was in the package, too. We'll make sure to take care of you, okay? Obviously, we can only do as much as we can in terms of safely shipping packages at the end of the day because the post office is going to be the post office, but we can still go out of our way to take care of you even if it isn't something that we could have prevented in the first place. And here we go, guys, for Tampa Bay three times. One, two... Three. Cards fan 25. Three times. You got him. Congratulations. No matter what, you are going to have a stack of wanders. Right, let me grab that case real quick. All right, guys, here we go. I mean, guys, once again, the only thing left on this site, the big grand finale, big kahuna, the true group break 4,000 of the night. The second craziest break we've ever done. Check it out. Even if you're not a hockey person, that is like a holy grail level break. We are literally opening every single Dominion they ever made. Dominion is... It, it was hard to, people were asking about it. It's like, it, for, for 10, 11 Dominion and 11, 12 Dominion, it was on par with the cup. And then we have a case of 12, 13 prime, which prime hockey is of its own. It's, it's incredible. Uh, memorabilia focus, which is insane mem. Um, that was the origin of essentially the full card jumbo patch came from prime. Um, and then 13, 14 Dominion, it, it took like a turn, it, it changed. Um, and it, it was like its own product. Uh, because they had NT that year, so it was just a different a different vibe. But one of every single year, for those who are like, why is 1213 Prime in a Dominion break? It's because in 1213, there wasn't Dominion because of the lockout. Uh, they only had a few products um, compared to normal. And so what they did was they put Dominion packs on top of every Prime box. And so each box of Prime has both a Prime pack and a Dominion pack. And so the only way to get 1213 Dominion is to open 1213 Prime Hockey. So I couldn't do a Dominion Anthology break without bringing in some 1213 Prime and getting our shot at, shoot, I think Jake Allen. I remember we had to open that to get his rookie cards from 1213 uh, Dominion, but a lot of nuggets in there that people forget about since it wasn't its standalone product. But we've, hit, we've hit so many shields from Dominion packs out of Prime Hockey. It's pretty crazy. All right, guys, here we go. If it's your first time breaking Bowman with us, guys, we will ship all of the rookies, all of the chrome, all of the first Bowman paper 
to you guys. Matt will, uh, when he gets back, he's actually on vacation this week. He's coming back this weekend, though, and he's going to sort ship everything over the weekend. So he'll go through all this and get all those pulled out for you guys. Um, this is the last case of Bowman we've got. Now we wait for uh, Bowman Chrome. Yeah. What's up, Ace? Bowman Hobby, last one. We have absolutely crushed Bowman Baseball this year. I think, was it last case when we hit that other, uh, we hit the uh, Wander Atomic Auto again? And then after I finish opening this stack of packs, I will grab the sleeves and top loaders. I forgot to get those. But case of hobby. And then remember, all the giveaways so far in play, the last giveaway, which is huge, 350 in value. It's two spots in the next pearl break. Well, two winners, by the way. That will go in as two different prizes. That way we can have as many winners as possible. But as long as you guys fill hockey, by the time we get to it, which you have plenty of time, you got this whole case plus the gargantuan football. As long as you fill hockey by the time we get to it, those will be included in the giveaway for you guys. I'll start with these, and I'm going to have to go get a, another set of sleeves. I don't think, yeah, I don't think I have enough there. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. We'll show off all the, uh, uh, the parallels, the numbered, and the autos. But we'll still ship all your rookies, first Bowman papers. Ronnie Mauricio, first Bowman Atomic for the New York Mets Emperor. Try to. I'm still trying to. I have a little more room. Oh, well, there's our first orange. Look at that. The 25 McKenzie Gore for the Padres. So if you pick San Diego, you're already a winner. I see C dubs right there. The 25 Gore. There's our first 25 or less low number. Tirso Ornelas to four ninety nine for San Diego. C Dubs O two Refractor Auto for San Diego. Usually, typically in a hobby box, three parallels beyond refractors, not counting those, and an auto. That is a typical box of hobby. Sometimes you'll sneak in a few extra uh, color. To 125, that's nice. Julio Pablo Martinez for Texas. S4. Julio Pablo to 125. And to 499, Taylor Widener for Arizona. So I got the refractor in there, so a little bit of a bonus there. Box number two. So first one with an orange. 
Typically, at least half of the boxes have an orange or better. That, at least the way we've gone so far this year with Bowman. Here we go. Round two. Uh, Soup, it's Ace. Magic Ace. What's up, Rudy? I just saw you say that. Ian Anderson for Atlanta. Four ninety nine blue paper. White Speckle to two ninety nine. Albert Abreu for the Yankees. Grouch. Brent Rooker for the Twins, Atomic, Volk, and Jose Altuve to 250, Purple Paper for Houston, Jazzmaster. Yeah, and Tim, I will tell you this. Um, there is a well, picked up right on the auto. There is a guy who I've actually sold a one of one Limburg to in the past. It was nothing even close to what you have, and I sold it to him for seven hundred dollars, and he is bidding. Um, so that that you will that Limburg will do very well. <laughs> that Limburg will do very well. Brock Deathridge for Detroit. Bank of Dad, first Bowman Auto. By the way, guys, I was on the phone today with uh, Brian Gray, president of Leaf, um, and he confirmed he has not seen the Michael Jordan Wayne Gretzky duel. And uh, we were talking; he thinks that is value-wise the biggest card in the product. Luis Patino for San Diego. So San Diego double dipping on oranges to twenty-five. To twenty-five. So we've already had three or four color and our auto. John, there's at least one Cyclone left. I'm trying to think of the other card that I asked about. And a Lord Stanley. I said, obviously all this is just based on what they know. In theory, someone could open something in their house and never tell anybody. It just typically isn't how collectors behave these days. <laughs> typically, it gets hit and it's immediately on the interwebs. Exactly. Yeah. And when I told him how much I had, he was actually quite surprised and and was fairly confident that we have a large percentage of the remaining product that's left to open on Pearl. Because uh, he, he was he was basing it off of obviously what was opened on release and how much he saw get opened um, in Toronto. He told me that one person in Toronto at the expo, one person opened six cases. 
at the booth in front of them. And so, I mean, six cases on a 150 case run is, I mean, 4% of the product. Yeah, that's 4% of the product right there. One guy, boom, gone. So in my opinion, our, our pearl breaks are becoming more and more and more valuable as we go. I'm not changing the price on them, but as the odds get better and better for some of these massive hits to come out, man, oh man. Here we go, box number three. Yeah. Box number three. I see gold. Roberto Ramos first Bowman gold to 50. Colorado. Win old 75. More orange. I see it. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Atomic Wander. Cards fan 25. There's a pretty one. I'll just leave it here in just a second. And then nice one for the White Sox. Nick Madrigal. Bold fan 91. Orange to 25. So if anyone picked the White Sox, they're also on the board. And Ryan Borucki for Toronto. Mnum, rookie autograph for the Blue Jays. Bunch of color already on this one too. Well, I, guess, I guess we're waiting on, no, we've had an atomic, a gold, and an orange. So. Maybe one more parallel if we get lucky. Nope. Box number four. So three for three on oranges. Like I said, it, it rains oranges with hobby, which, and in, in, in Bowman, Bowman Chrome, Bowman Draft, all that. Um, Orange is, I mean, it's pretty much the most desirable color other than red and super fractors. People love their orange. It seems to be the one that just like, it stays affordable compared to a red or a super. And so people go nuts. Like the multiplier on orange is better per dollar than even dropping down to gold. Number four. Here we go. 
box four. Sandro Fabian, number to 250 for the Giants purple paper, Cree fan. Jose Altuve to four ninety nine for Houston. Okay. One numbered in that handful. Spangenberger, four ninety nine. First Bowman refractor for Toronto. Numb. That could potentially be all of our parallels. Oh, here's an atomic coming. Jay Groom, atomic for Boston. Rudy. Rookie of the Year favorites autograph for the Atlanta Braves, the 150, Colby Allard, S4. Rookie of the Year favorites auto to 150. Box number five. Number five. Here we go. We got a blue right off the bat. Blue Shimmer Carter Key Boom to 150 for the Nationals. Rudy. A little blue shimmer shimmer. Suli Matias Bowman Chrome Auto for Kansas City, a Cranger for the Royals. Should have a couple more color. Griffin Canning for the Angels. Atomic. Jazz Master. Leody Tavares to 125 for Texas. 
S4. And number to 150, Anders Jimenez, Andres Jimenez, sorry, for the New York Mets. Top 100 Atomic. And box number six. The halfway point. I feel like I'm doing pretty good, even without Matt here. Case of Bowman Hobby in under an hour, I think. That's pretty pretty darn strong. And then, guys, after this, we've got the Gargantuan football break. And then, last break of the night, the Colossus of Clout, the giant, the biggest break we have done in freaking five years. And the only other one bigger. What's up, Draz? Was, I think, the the Panini Anthology Hockey Break that we did every Panini product that they ever made for hockey in one break. That one was that one took so long to put together I had to search everywhere for like a couple boxes that were just elusive. But next to that, um tonight's Dominion break can never be done again at this price, like ever. I had to plan for this. Track the cases down, negotiate pricing that was actually like reasonable because everyone that has 10 11 and 11 12 dominion sealed cases they are holding on to them like crazy those products were game changers in terms of high-end product completely changed the game yeah football is sold out and Draz, thanks brother Luis Robert to 250. White Sox. Purple Refractor. Then we have a Cabrian Hayes. Atomic for Pittsburgh. Mayhem. And Jose Abreu to 150. Blue paper for the White Sox. Oh, how about an Israel Wilson orange first Bowman auto for the Braves S4 to 25. First Bowman auto orange is Ronald Wilson. For the Atlanta Braves, S4. Boom, baby. To 150, Andrew Neisner for St. Louis Cards Van. Orange auto in a case is always good. All right, one second, guys. Box seven coming up next.
box seven. So Braves, Sox, and Padres so far on everyone who picked low numbers. And then guys, all the giveaways except for the hockey giveaway have been locked in as long as hockey's full. By the time we get to it after the Gargantuan football break, that will lock all those in. At the end of the night, we'll have a huge drawing. We already gave away a sick Ryan Sandberg right before this break. So we're also doing chat giveaways. And then one of the things that just, it's, it's insane. Until you win it and then you go spend it, you don't realize like how crazy it is. But someone tonight, in one of the breaks, every every spot in, in the breaks is an entry. Someone's going to win 4,000 reward points, boys. Someone's going to win 4,000 reward points. Yes, I showed it, Caddy. Uh, I'll, I can pull it out after this. I think I already put it in the box. You're <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> Dustin May, the 299 white speckle for the Dodgers. Yeah, 4,000 reward points is, is equivalent on average of $40,000 and buy on the website. You would have to spend 40,000 bucks on average to get 4,000 reward points. Makes me sick to my stomach a little. Oh, we got more orange. Holy smokes, guys. This is insane. Orange shimmer coming. Come on, be the auto. That'd be crazy. I think it's a little early for the auto, but you can dream, right? Yuzniel Diaz, the 25 orange shimmer for Baltimore. Win hole 75. So Baltimore's a winner if you pick them for a low number. And Gabriel Kensel, Atomic First Bowman Auto for Kansas City, a Cranger. Getting into some beautiful parallel autos now. An orange and an Atomic. Four ninety nine Spangenberger, Blue Paper First Bowman, Toronto M Num. Mackenzie Gore for San Diego. C dubs, Atomic.
Here we go. Well, look at that. Ryan Costello, first Bowman Auto for the Minnesota Twins. Volk. For the Twins. Right out of the gate on that one. Christian Pash. Atomic for Atlanta. Four ninety nine. Tristan McKenzie for Cleveland. Refractor. I think one more color, maybe. Yep, right on the back. To one twenty five. Carter Keyboom for Washington. Keyboom. For the Nationals. Box nine. Box number nine. Quit poking dress. And guys, once again, just a reminder, we will not be breaking tomorrow. Um, last minute, um, I decided, you know what? This is the closest the Blues have ever been to the cup in my life. And so uh, I actually I actually was smart about it. And I, well, I, I should say, shouldn't say smart. I made a calculated risk. And uh, Friday... Friday after they won, I was like, you know what? I really have a feeling they're going to win in San Jose and have a chance to clinch at home. And so Friday before that game ended, I purchased tickets for tomorrow. Now those tickets are through the freaking roof. Thank goodness. I kind of rolled it up. How I looked at it was worst case scenario, they're not going to drop much, even if it's not a clincher. So um, I snagged them up. And once they won yesterday, I decided that was going to happen. And so tomorrow, I'll be driving over to St. Louis, attending the game tomorrow night, and then driving immediately back, hopefully get back by about 3 a.m. or so, and uh, we'll still be, we'll have our releases on Wednesday. So tomorrow's a day off, first one in a while. First one in a while. Chad Spangenberger to 125 for Toronto. And also, you're going to want to pay attention to the Facebook group tomorrow because um, there's going to be there's going to be a contest and giveaway associated with me attending the game tomorrow. Jeter Downs for the Dodgers, Atomic. And let's just say I will be uh, John Duplantier. I think that's Arizona, right? Yep, Diamondbacks. That's the orange. If anyone picked Arizona, also on the board for low number, win holes. But I will be sitting. This is actually kind of a fluke. I did not even know this is where I was sitting when I bought the tickets. They were just the cheapest ones I could find, like in the in the area I was looking. Evan White to 250 for Seattle. But I will be in one of the most easily recognizable spots in the entire stadium throughout the entire broadcast. Tomorrow for the game. Uh, Montero for the Cardinals. First Bowman Auto. So you're going to want to watch. And you're going to want to watch the group so you can see the details for the contest. I'm going to wait till I get to the game just to make sure like, you know, like everything goes smooth and 
and and and it's and it works for the contest, but there will be a contest for the game uh dealing with social media and you're going to want to watch. And it's going to be everyone it's going to be an everyone wins type of deal. Everyone who participates is going to win. It's going to be pretty cool. I'm really excited. I'm I'm giddy. I'm not even going to lie. Once the breaks are over tonight, I'm just like I don't know if I'm going to stop smiling until like hopefully tomorrow. Well, hopefully not even tomorrow because hopefully we win and then smiles for like a long time. Are you going to be the goalie? <laughs> but I'm I'm freaking pumped. <laughs> Dress. Oh boy, am I getting homework? You're getting hockey homework. Well, Cree fan, I'll make sure I'll make sure that Draz as long as Draz is cool with this, I'll make sure Draz uh tweets it out and how about this? Tweet we'll tweet it out and I'll also make it the ticker bar on the website. So that way if you don't do any social media, Twitter, Facebook, all that then you can still come to the website and I'll update the ticker bar because that's something that I can do easily um, on my mobile. Um, and so I will do that as well. That way for anyone who doesn't have social media. Hey, Cree fan, do you have uh, Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram? Any of those three? Twitter? Perfect. Nope, that's perfect. So you can you can watch for the update on the site. Um, Draz might tweet it as well, but then to participate, Twitter will work once you know what once you know what to do. And yep, you can follow those guys on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, all three. Draz is actually in charge of those accounts. Mwahaha. And so he will be able to update that stuff for you guys. Yeah, at Clubhouse Breaks. DM nudes for discounts. <laughs> Blaze Alexander to 250. First Bowman purple paper for Arizona. That's a one color in the first stack. Check and stack. I think I saw blue in there. Oh. Jojo Romero. Atomic for Philadelphia. Oh, nice. That's usually a bonus to 199. Tristan Casas. I cannot remember what team he was. Tristan Casas. What team is he, guys? The All-America Auto. I think that's the second case in a row we got the bonus. Red Sox. Rudy. With the bonus ink. So if, last time it was a bonus. I'm assuming it is every time. Yep, here we go. Kyle Tucker to 499. Rookie auto refractor for Houston. Jazz Master. Four ninety nine, Keegan Thompson for the Cubs.
box 11. Box 11. And I need to go get penny sleeves real quick. Two ninety nine Dom Thompson Williams White Speckle for the New York Yankees. Oh, need to get the leaves. Little white speckle action right on the top. So, so it's weird. Some of them are just right away. Some of them are not. Alex Faedo for Detroit. Estevan Florial for the Yankees Atomic. Royce Lewis to 150. Blue Refractor, Minnesota Twins. This one has a few paper cards that have like indentions. It's like one of the packs was tagged on the side. Might have been an edge box or something. Jeff, nope. Football is next. And then ending the night with the big kahuna. Four case, crazy high end hockey break.
Drez, I have not. No, it's going to run right after this. I will run that $39 one right after this. Nolan Gorman, the 150 blue paper for the Cardinals. Yules Neil Diaz, Atomic for Baltimore. Four ninety nine, Jacob deGrom for the Mets. To one fifty, Ryan Montcastle for Baltimore. Ready for the show with Atomic. What auto is in? In the last, well, one of these last two stacks. There it is. Asturi Ruiz, first Bowman auto for San Diego. Padres. For the Padres. And should have at least one more color, I believe. There we go. Christian Santana to 150. Blue Shimmer, first Bowman for the LA Dodgers. Guys, there you have it. Group break 4001, I believe. Bowman Hobby Baseball.